nothing to you. I, you know something? When this show's up and running, we're going to have a camera rolling 24-7. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, ready? Okay. And... Hi, I'm Brenda Cooper. And I'm Renee Taylor. And this is our dear friend, Alejandro Calvani. So the other day, I'm in Saks with Renee. We're shopping, and I'm just walking through the makeup department. And this gentleman, Alejandro, goes, Hello, Brenda. And I look at him, or I look at him this way. I go, How do you know my name? And he goes, Oh, I know you from Fashion Emergency and when you were costume designing The Nanny. And I'm like, Wow, he told me it was his favorite shows. It still is. It still is. And then I said to him, do you know that I'm here with Renee Taylor from The Nanny? Do you want to meet her? So I introduced them, oh. and we have become friends. And, and he, he did my makeup. Yes. And he's one of our special forces of style. And today he's going to talk about doing beauty. beauty our favorite tell, subject. Tell everybody what you said about my makeup. How the colors that I wore when I did The Nanny or when I do movies and that you thought I should be more, what? Softer? Yes. Yes, so makeup for a lady who's 83. Give us some quick tips. Glamour at 83. Soft, neutral tones, pop of color on the lips. Um, if anything, when you get older, you need to add more blush. Okay, and, and I can absolutely support what he's saying because I've known my dear friend Renee for over 20 years. I've seen a million makeup artists work on her and when I saw the work that Alejandro had done I was completely wowed because nothing personal Renee it's easy to make you look like a drag queen like that as a matter of fact female impersonators send me pictures and I say I don't remember wearing that dress <laughs> I don't even know that it isn't me because they do such a good job but I had an argument with him because he said this is a dirty word to me, and it has been for a long time. More subtle. <laughs> you actually told me to be more subtle. Yes, and I've actually had that issue with you myself. But, but Renee's been open to it, and you just... Alejandro makes you look so pretty. Thank now, you. Now, we've talked about your favorite subject. What about me? <laughs> so I'm, like, what, 20 years younger? To rounding or out, so you say. Or so I say, rounding out... To, you know, 60, so, and you've been making me up, so give me some tips for all our 60-year-olds. The less, the better. The less, the better. Ladies, the less, the better. Can you believe that? When everyone's, like, plastering makeup on themselves as they get older, our tip is from Alejandro. Why? Well, the thing is, in California, I realize women like to wear matte makeup. And uh. matte makeup, even though it does not reflect light, because it's good for TV, it makes you look very old. So dewy skin is really the thing. Okay. And when you are a, a woman of a certain age, you lose that dew, so you got to add the dew. Right, so uh, to wrap up this se segment, dewy is in, dewy skin is in, and women of a certain age... To the wrap only problem wrap is when you get subtle, you might look too young. Right, and we're struggling with that right now. Yes. And on that note, if you have a comment about makeup, too much makeup, too little makeup... Send anything. us your picture on YouTube. Right. And leave a comment below. Until next time, we love you.